Chilly, like, we were gonna right. go to the beach, but it's cold. Right. We was in the streets. I'm not going to the beach. In the streets. So we're just gonna take a little boat cruise. Listen to us. Today. They're supposed to give us a tour about South Carolina. Tour to South Carolina, South Carolina, which is good. We probably get some eating and we out. Okay, yeah, we're going to. I know people in Alabama. Yeah, we headed back our way. Look, I keep saying it. We headed back our way to Mobile, Alabama. And like I said, uh, hopefully, I got my charge for this. I don't know, something going on with this camera, but we're going to figure yeah, it out, Yeah, our though. camera is tripping, but we're we trying to get in a lot of footage. As much as we can. If we got to use our phone, we will, but we really don't want to. So oh, let's see. I'll show y'all a glimpse of it. Yo, let's go. We at the harbor, man. We at the harbor, man. Uh, look at that line to get on. Y'all, we thought we were the early. harbor. Yeah. Negative. We thought we were early, but I guess not. <laughs> guess not. I guess we're late. <laughs> Guess we're a little late to the party, but um, yeah, we're here. So hopefully we have a good time. This hopefully they, they have all your BMWs there in Charleston, South Carolina. Mm -hmm. And the keys are in them. Uh, in case you decide you want to drive off, we'll see. Hopefully it don't yeah. rain. Drive straight in that water. <laughs> So we get on this little boat slash ferry slash whatever, and they, they take us like around. They have like dreams. They have like a whole bar and stuff. That is the way to allow us to accommodate the largest ships in the world once that's been completed. We also have a very busy port here in Charleston. Over 2,000 ships and barges coming here each year. And that has an economic impact in excess of $64 billion. Mm, kind of in a normal yeah, year, over 150 cruise ships will call on Charleston. He do a lot. 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 Which caused the entire building mm -hmm. to lean to the right. Both George Washington and General Robert E. Lee attended services so there. So we were in the inside. Times. So they had like a top deck. Mm -hmm. So they had the inside part. But like everybody filled up the top deck because we were late. <laughs> and so we went in the inside. The inside was pretty cool too though. Yeah. You can have a whole party down there. Oh yeah. It was spacious. Just, if the boat go under though, just make sure you It was like there. these Mormon kids and they was having them a good time. This family they were had. Were they like, Mormon? Yeah. Well, if you have the right last name, or you marry into the right family, the chance of you becoming a Charles and Harbor Pot is just about no, zero. The smaller boats to our right, those are located at the Carolina Yacht Club. The Carolina Yacht Club was established in 1883, making it the oldest, most prestigious yacht club in the area. Yeah, I want to go over there next time, though. Oh, yeah. We have people over there. Well, we, yeah, when we go, though, we said we're just going to fly into Charleston and go to Myrtle Beach and all that good stuff. Just hang out in. I'm going to stay off the beach, though. I'm going to come out. Yes, yeah, they had, y'all, when I was looking, they had some nice stuff. That's what works at our house, including the gold bomb. And get some tricks. This is also the location of the first major naval engagement of the Revolutionary War. June 28, 1776, one week prior to the signing of the Declaration of Independence. So, yeah, we was just getting it, man. Getting it. What is the mm -hmm. We went from a trolley. That's a, that's a limit. We need to put that in there today. Uh, Several years of Patriots for they've been spending a ton of money. A few years ago, the USS Life was taken to the shipyard and her entire bottom for place at a cost of $15 million. They recently painted the house of Fort Sumter. The other is over at Patriots Point, which is the most recent place in the Patriots Point. Yeah, they said we got the BMWs, y'all, with the keys in them. Then we have a low-rise building, a construction site, and a trolley. Let's start off the boat. That was pretty about, interesting. About to go leave. Go leave. So, We're about to leave. Going our way to Alabama. Out this thing. So we took a tour there. of Charleston. We will be back to Charleston, but we're probably going to just ride directly here. Because yeah. we're going to go hit up Myrtle Beach when it's not cold. Because it's cold, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> you know. You know how we are. Yeah. So. We're from Texas. It don't be cold like that. Mm -mm. So stay, stay tuned. We're going to get on the, on the um, next move. All right. Here we go. All right, what's up, good people? Here we go, man. I was later uh, in Alabama. In Alabama. The office. That was a little room. weird. All right, so walk in this room. Cool. You got your little iron. You got your little. Yeah, that's y'all see, see, see how he giving y'all this tour? The bathroom. Because I ain't ever been And I was confused so why the coffee was on the bathroom. That's the room. room. That was uh, let's see what's in this bathroom. 
Oh, yeah, so that's the bathroom sink. The other thing if it's not. All right. Like I said, we only stay here one night, so we don't have to be too fancy. Yeah, it was cool, though. It was just a weird layout. you got your TV right there. Oh, you know, you got like your microwave, your refrigerator, your bed. Oh. You got it nice and neat, folded oh. up. That's the one you like uh, the sheets. You see the difference? This room is not I as big as the other one was. Y'all, so we that's another thing we didn't say. So, on. like, I got, like, lights off, lights off. Like, uh, every hotel we went to, I like to get down so. Even though it was already, most of, no, all of them were, like, pretty clean. Fans, Thanks for traveling with us. Thanks for sharing this vlog with everybody you know. If you're traveling, Make sure you take your lights off. We got here in Alabama, then we got um, Memphis, and then Memphis to New Orleans, and then back to the cruise. Y'all, this is where we get to the hotel. We get ready to eat, and they mess up our order. Hey. What up, people? All right, we are in Montgomery, Alabama. Yes, Montgomery, Alabama, the one you read about in the history books. We are on our way to the... All change. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, we gotta get an oil change, y'all, because we've been driving so much in this room that, that the they me. maintenance said, oil so came on, but, I mean, for the most part, we've been doing good in this I'm part, not, but I'm we're gonna go ahead and get the oil change just to be safe, because we want to make it back I home. Myself, don't All worry. Right. Um, so we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna head over to the um, memorial. Um, yeah, we're gonna head over to the Martin Luther King. Memorial and it's like a civil rights trail, but we're gonna record it so you guys can see it. Of course, we're gonna take you along cool. with us just in case you decide to come to Alabama. You can check it out. Um, yeah, cool, and then tonight we will be heading. Well, this evening we'll be heading to Memphis, Tennessee, um, to also visit the traveling, memorial, traveling, well, the man. hotel where Martin Luther King was well, rain, um, so assassinated. Um, and then from there. We're heading back our way. We're going to stop. Of course, you can't pass up New Orleans without stopping there. Um, so we that will be our last stop. And then we will head home. So we got it. Um, so continue to play Travel <laughs> Grace. Got to get we'll lit when you close to the home. Bye. <laughs> Oh, Trying to take y'all with us, man. This was, we had to go to one place. Yeah, to yeah. They have like three things. Mm hmm. So we had to go here and go. Oh, we had to really put them to the other spot first. first. All right, let's okay, go. No. I'm going to let y'all so see this go going down. Someone over here talking to this dude. He gave us some instructions. What you gotta go do? Your purse? Yeah. I got this open? Purse in the trunk, purse in the trunk. Playing around, playing around. Whatever. <laughs> this is the first trip you were patient. He did good, y'all. He did real good. Patient. Patient. Been training you for a while now, so. Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Been training him for a while, so Whatever you know, means. hard work yeah. pays off. Anyway, so it was pretty interesting because we got to go to the little tombstone or whatever. So we had went to the other place. That's another area. I mean, this is another area. We went from Texas. Oh, okay. Not too far, whatever. What they call? Yeah. <laughs> okay. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. Oh, Buff. Dot com over there. Okay. Mm -hmm. no we might be too early, huh? No. Super no, tight shirt, McGee. Yeah. Alabama, y'all. Y'all, nah, this I, was so funny because we could not figure out this parking meter thing for the longest. Yeah, but and we so figured I went it out. So I got some quarters. I have to find some quarters. Yeah, we figured it out because when we came out, the lady had a ticket. Yeah, we came out. Somebody else had a ticket. And she was mad. She was like, I put money in there. I paid. It is fire. You were taking too long, ma'am. You were not No, we weren't supposed to have a camera here, but guess what? I brought it in there. Yeah, so it's probably going to look a little rocky. Ooh, it was so emotional. That was crazy because there was a lot of uh, people in there and they were being weird. Man, they had, they had like little prison cells. 
and they had people in there like they had like the holograms. And tell singing. her what the lady was trying to do. Which one? I can't remember. She was trying to open the thing. Oh, yeah. Is, I said, you want to get in there? I'll, I'll, get, I'll oh, yeah. lock it for you. Because they had like... She said, uh-huh, I know. It's like prison cells, <laughs> but they was at, they had different... You'll see why. Like, check this out. Y'all, this lady was trying to get in the freaking thing. She was like... She was in there singing, man. It's so emotional, though. Yeah, this is like a lot. It's like the slavery days. It's, so, and then the other one, I had these two kids that were saying, Mama, Mama. Man, it touches your heart, though. I'm telling y'all. Yeah, y'all have to go. Like, every black person should see this. It really touches your heart, though. I promise you. And made her way as fast as possible. And I snuck that camera in there. I want that camera in there. Because it's so emotional. And then you have people bringing their kids, and their kids are like, mm-hmm. Mommy, are you a slave? Yeah, we heard that. That was crazy. I love that girl. Like, that's just like, that is, yeah. how do you even answer that question? This is the outside of the building. Negative to the museum. So. We got a little bit of footage, not much. We got a little bit of footage in the museum, but we're going to definitely get some at the memorial. But, girl, if you have not been, you definitely have to go in the game. It's in Montgomery, Alabama. You'll see it in the vlog. Uh, The name, the the name. The tickets are absolutely free. You can make a donation if you would like um, to the museum, any any amount. Um, So, yeah, you definitely need to check it out if you're here. Also, make sure you bring coins for the meter because they have these old school meters, as you can see in front of us right coins, here. Coins, coins, coins. Um, for parking um, that you have to pay. Make sure you pay because this lady next to us just came out and she had a ticket on her car. Yep. Um, so you can put coins in there and then they have an app that you can download to pay as well. But I would that recommend that you bring, right. just bring coins. It's easier so you don't have to go through all that. Um, but now we're headed over to the memorial. I'm like, y'all, it's just so mind-blowing of our history, man. Um, and so that's really what this trip is all about, is just learning more about our history, especially with everything that's going on right now within the black community. Um, this stuff is really eye-opening because we have to do better as a people, and we have to do better as a country. Um, but as a people, we have to do better Um as far as taking a stand and building something, building a legacy, because our ancestors created the way, they paved the way, but we have to continue it. Like, it's so many of our people that aren't doing anything. You're just living life like you're not Not doing anything. You're not finding a purpose. You're not doing anything. They fought for us to have these privileges, and we have them, and we're doing nothing with it. And so... That was, this is looking dumb. eye opening. And what we're going to show you next is probably going to be even more eye opening. How do you feel, babe, as a black man? It was very emotional, man. When we went in there, man, and it's just, they don't want you to record anything. I gave y'all a little footage, but man, that stuff, man. I mean, my whole thing, when I, when I look at that, it's like, we came so far, but we got so far to go. So we far to change go. our mindset. We got to gotta create wealth for ourselves. We can't depend on somebody else to give us money. We got to create money. This is the greatest opportunity we have in front of us living in America. So, Take man. And living free. Free. Y'all, everywhere that we've been and we've talked to black people or met black people, South Carolina. What the uh, hell are y'all doing in, here? In, in Alabama, they're like, what are y'all doing here? <laughs> we're like, oh, you know, we're touring. They're like, oh, y'all are in the best place. So if you live in Texas, Come on. you're in one of the best places Free. to drive. Like, people are literally trying to get to Texas. But like, you're struggling. Stop you know? playing with me. So just try Free. to maximize every opportunity. Um, but, again, we're going to head over to the memorial, and then we're going to – they have, like, another little gift shop area and stuff like that um, that we're going to go to. I also saw a little bookstore over here. 
Um, and I think they sold like a lot of black history books and stuff. We wasn't going there. But anyway, there. we'll see y'all in a bit. No, we weren't going there. There's a lot of people in there. That yeah, this it. part was very oh, emotional too. I remember seeing it when I was watching Wilder and them. The boxer, uh, Dante Wilder. I remember seeing it. I'm like, man, I gotta yeah. go there. Man. And we went. I've seen people video. Cause we, remember we yeah. on somebody. Man. No, you can bring your camera. But you can't bring the tripod in. Yeah, they took our tripod. Stop they playing with me. Tripod. I might fly my drone <laughs> over had, that place. We had to get it on our way out. Stop playing with me. I might fly my drone Y'all know there. I had to keep him. Because you know how he is. That's dumb, though. Like that. How you can bring your camera, but you can't bring a tripod? That don't make sense. Yeah, man, this is very, very, very emotional. And they made sure that they told people to um, be very respectful of this. Because you're pretty sure people was doing some dumb stuff around that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Like getting on their back. Like, you know, people do dumb stuff, humping them. This is serious, man. It's very emotional, though. What's up, guys? Man, this is, man, this is very heartfelt. Just look at how they was just in bondage. Um, it's crazy. All because of the color you're seeing. No other reason. No other reason. All because the color of your skin, bro. It's deep. Very emotional, man. Alright, so this place right here was they said they was caught they was caught cotton um pickers. Yeah. That got tortured. Mm-hmm. But to me, the other dude said it this is just a high net price for a slave. Yep. And these and these are different people. They got their name when they died. And then some of them don't don't have names because they couldn't identify the body. Yep. And they got tortured, man. Oh my god. Whatever. I call it so tombstone. This, yeah, this whatever. is in memory of them. Yes. This is in memory of them, man. It's, whew. Give me a cigarette, somebody. Cause this is just getting a little bit too emotional for me. It's crazy. It was crazy. And it's a lot. So like I mean, thousands, all the way around. thousands, man, getting tortured. I'm talking about, we're not just talking about, I'm talking about they actually torching your butt. You know what I'm saying? Tying you up to horses and pulling you and just whatever they want to do to make they self feel, feel good. I mean, this perspective right here, just, just look at all this, man. And remember, multi, um, each one of those had multiple names on it. So it wasn't just one name. Yeah, had five, six, seven names on them. So it's very, like, just makes you think, like, man, why y'all torturing people like that? What did they do to y'all? Probably enough. This was, they said they was cotton pickers. Mm. Nah, slaves still to me. Man, another dude said, that black dude said his mom lived in Houston, though, remember? Yeah, his parents lived, yeah. Spring. Yeah, yeah Spring, Texas. I'm like, why are you still in Alabama? You're the hell you in Alabama, boy. And I want to go to Selma, but he was saying how Selma is just so like, I think this is the prince, and he's like, Selma is like, still looks like they just picked up and left. Everything looks the same. Wow. I had a whole bunch of like different quotes and stuff like that along the wall. Uh, it was, like I said, it was very, uh, very emotional, man. Very heartfelt. You know, we went around, had more quotes, and it's like you can kind of feel the the slave mentality vibe. I mean, some of the stuff they were saying was legendary. Yeah. So, but you can just feel the vibe, like man, it's just speaking about it. We also met um, a group of pastors. Oh yeah, they was cool. And they were like. They like going like a road trip, I guess, every year mm-hmm. and tour different spots. They were really nice. Yeah, so um, I just tell y'all, 
We got it on video. And they don't man. allow you on the grass. Ask me, I know. We do not allow you. She stepped on. Oh, for God. Yeah, let's try to take a photo. Girl. I tell you, do not get on the grass. Do not. It's, it's like a sacred place. Don't, don't get on the grass. But, like I said, remember, these are more tunes right here. These are more, I call them tunes, or whatever they was calling them, but these are, these are different people who got tortured, man. All this, man, it's crazy. It just make you think, like, wow. Back then, that could have been me. Could have been your, it could have been some of your, your relatives that you don't even know about. I definitely wouldn't want to live in Alabama. I'm sure there's a nice part, though. But still. No, I don't know about that. <laughs> Savannah had a lot of black cops, too. Yeah. A whole bunch of black cops in Savannah. It was a lot of black people. Maybe working, they all seen working in, in the secret place. Working at this. It place. might be in that secret place though. I don't know. There were like all black workers at this place. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they talked about getting lynched. You know, I mean, it just kind of bring you. And they also had was that Rosa Parks? Yeah, Rosa Parks over here. Is this here or the Moran no, Hotel? Yeah, it's here. yeah, I ain't need to go in there. The other part, they ain't got nothing right there. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, after seeing all that, I'm good. Yeah. Yeah, so that is three statues, man, of just strong black women. It's crazy, man. Man, this is, I mean, I just can't imagine living back then, though. I'd rather die. So you then then for me to be a slave. Period. Period. And I'm pretty sure a lot of people felt like that's why they got killed and tortured. Another thing to this other part right here, it was interesting though how they had you remember how we do like hands up? They still got hands up. This is back then. They had a hand, hands no, up. No, yeah, hands up, don't shoot. Yep. Nine hands up, don't shoot. But they had them. Oh, hands this up. is like when I was kind of standing on the grass while I forgot. They don't want to show the grass. Okay. It's just crazy, though, man, when you think about this. Look at that. Oh, my God. It's crazy, man. Like, wow. So went to uh, what was this place called? Miss B. Miss B. So good. It was good. It was good. I wanted to try Alabama South. All of them The yams, they look like my big mama yams, so I know they're gonna be good. And then I got the fried chicken. The chicken back. So, I feel like it didn't smell like I've been to the country. <laughs> well, you know, like where your grandparents be cooking it and smell like a house full of grease and all that extra. And that's how I smell. But y'all, the food was on point. The oh, only thing too. that wasn't on point that we got them on in the country in, te- in Texas is the um, cornbread. Okay. Corn, I ain't got them on the cornbread, bread, but y'all. They, man, they y'all better stop putting all that sugar in that cornbread. Was it wasn't Jesse. Oh, Lord. When your yams you look like my sugar big mama yams, it almost tastes like my big mama yams. You got me. Okay, and they don't look like mush with marshmallow on them. Ugh. You know how to cook yams. Okay, that was not planned. You know how to cook them yams. Everything was delicious. So if you're ever in Montgomery, Alabama, mm. if you decide to come to Memorial, it's about maybe eight miles from the memorial um check them out it's miss b's i'm gonna try to show y'all the sign and, the and we did that not did happen because and, um, yeah, they've had oh, the he was the fried yeah. fish with corn what you have corn and oh, yams. and yams um corn and yams and fried fish was was mad. It was good, i had the sweet tea it that fucking YouTube. tea was so fucking but sugar. Anyway, you were sugar down. Oh, the Kool Aid. And then the lady was like, You want another cup? You know, they always get it to the man. So we have made. He was like, Kool Aid. Yeah, Give me that Kool Aid. Yeah, we have made Kool Aid. Yeah, we have made Kool Aid. Yeah, we have Kool Aid. But we just pulled up to the hotel, about to check in. So it's about four hours later. Four hours later. We talked to y'all earlier. Um, and so now we're in Memphis. We're only here for a day. 
we're going to hopefully go prayerfully because it's a little drizzling right now. So hopefully tomorrow it clears Everything up. Everything came um, out good. We're going to go to the Martin Luther King, well, to the, the motel where Martin Luther King was assassinated. Um, probably grab some barbecue because Memphis is known for their yeah, barbecue, that, and then we're gonna go ahead and not to do the that. Went to the no. um, for a couple days, and then you know what's after the no? Home. <laughs> we're going home. Um, this has been an amazing trip. I just thank God for traveling grace. Um, still praying for traveling grace because we still have a we're lot back of home. traveling to do. But anyway, um, I guess I'm gonna show you guys the room when we get in. I'm not really sure what it looks like. Um, We've never stayed here. This is a hotel by the Radisson. Um, and so we'll see what that's like. But, oh, I'm so excited for the New, uh, New Orleans vlog because we're going to be there for a couple of days. And the hotel that we chose is like, oh, my God. That's, hey, we're going to finish it off with a bang. Um, so, yeah, I'm excited I feel about like that. The, that room, we're going to grab something to eat. Birthday, Go to our hotel. Yeah, I feel take like a shower, the best kind of in New Orleans. Um, and oh, we'll yeah. check in with it's nice. Kind of That's what New Orleans. Yeah. It's a bathroom. Nice. I don't know why the best Western. Yeah, I, I mean, not the Safari rooms. We, we, we didn't got, stay. We didn't Western stay at the best Western, but I looked at it. Oh. Got a little closet. We stayed at the. Well, y'all will see it. The sit down the couch. King size bed. TV. Pretty much, yeah. He tired at this room. point. You see, he give me y'all a little, little, little. Hope you guys yeah. enjoy. Yeah, yeah. Hope you guys enjoy. Tomorrow, I'm gonna be in the tomorrow. We'll see you guys tomorrow. About the chill, peace. About the chill, pop a pill, you know. Make things right.